Rafale Advanced Defense Systems has unveiled a new precision missile that can be launched from ships at sea or ground-based launches and hit targets at a distance of up to 300 kilometers. Called as Seabreaker, the missile is a naval and artillery unit force multiplier designed to overcome the challenges of the modern warfare arena. This fifth-generation precision-guided missile system is meant to hit high-value maritime and land targets. The missile is 4 meter long and weighs less than 400 kilograms and flies at high subsonic speeds towards its target. With infrared homing and automatic target recognition capabilities, it can be launched both during the day or night and in all weather conditions. Using artificial intelligence and other advanced technologies like deep learning and big data-based scene matching, the missile is able to automatically acquire and track targets. A feature that is available on the SPICE 2000 that was used during the Balakot strike. The SPICE 2000 is also manufactured by Rafale. Seabreaker can be used for various purposes, including sea-to-sea, -sea, sea land, land-sea, or land-to-land -land missions against high-value targets and can be launched from a naval platforms of varying size, from fast attack missile ships to corvettes and frigates. The company said, Seabreaker's mission profile enables sea skimming and terrain following low-level flight above ground. It also added that the missile's datalink supports real-time man-in-the-loop decision-making and tactical updates. It also features a mid-flight abort capability and battle damage assessment. Based on Rafale's spider launches, the Seabreaker can also be fired from vehicles such as Humvees or Dodge Rams, making it a versatile and mobile. It can hit targets in littoral or brown water, including archipelagos, and also strike targets where previous generation RF seeker-based missiles are not effective. The Seabreaker can fulfill operational missions without GPS and with minimum collateral damage. It also has a datalink support system that allows the operator to make decisions and tactical updates. Overall it can strike targets when you want, how you want, and from where you want. Though company sources said they would be offering the system to India in future with a possible Make in India initiative. But the country already has a similar product, BrahMos, an Indo-Russia missile system. The Israeli company also has an existing joint venture with Indian private firm Kalyani and is called the Kalyani Rafale Advanced Systems. This March, the joint venture rolled out its first batch of medium-range surface-to-air missile kits for the Indian Army and the Indian Air Force. Seabreaker vs BrahMos BrahMos missile can be launched against ships and land-based targets. The Seabreaker can be launched from naval platforms varying in size from fast attack missile boats to corvettes and frigates. The land version is based on Rafael's Spider air defense launches in service with the Indian Air Force. While the Seabreaker flies at high subsonic speeds, the BrahMos is a supersonic cruise missile and would be seen as a direct competition to the Israeli system. Adding extra weight in favor of BrahMos is that the missile can be fired from ships, land and air. Work is also on for a submarine launched BrahMos variant. While both missiles have a similar range, enhanced range versions of the BrahMos are already being rolled out. However, Rafale sources said the missile can be modified for air operation as well. If a customer so needs, and the speed can be made to supersonic too, in future.